News are getting ready for that chance of valley snow. Action News Now reporter Chloe Curtis is live in Chico near the Public Works Department. So Chloe, does the city have the gear to handle what's coming? The city doesn't have uh, gear for snow plowing of their own. However, if we do start to see snow on the ground, they are prepared to rent equipment to take care of that. Um, we also know that they're staffing up, so that includes Public Works, Chico Fire, and Chico Police as the storm rolls in. We're also expecting some heavy rain possibly over the next couple days in Chico. So if you are you know, worried about flooding in your area and trying to get your home prepared, the sound pile is still here at Chico Public works. It's a lot lower than it was last month, but there is still quite a bit of sand. You'll just have to bring shovels and bags for it, but it's another great way to prepare ahead of the storm rolling in. The city also wants people to remember to take things slow if you're going to be on the road the next couple of days. If we do see power outages in the area and that's impacting traffic lights, again, drive slowly and approach any traffic lights as a four-way stop and Again, just being careful and conscious while you're out on the road. For now, the weather hasn't been too crazy. I've been here near Public Works for the last several hours, and it's been pretty windy. There's been some sprinkling here and there, but other than that, haven't seen any snow quite yet. For now, live in Chico, Chloe Curtis, Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. I'll check with you later. Thank you, Chloe. You now, Reading also has snow plows at the ready. Emergency services and Reading Electric Utility are on alert. Report problems on our homepage under news links.